feet first. What? It floats. It floats. Wow, I really didn't. Welcome to Family Kid. Hi. Welcome to Family Kid. So today we're going to be doing a density experiment. So I hope that you're going to enjoy this one because it's going to be really fun. I'm going to let Opal tell you what we have. So what do we have, Opal? No, that's not sugar. Eh? That's salt. Water, salt, and egg. Eggs, yes, you're right. So you probably have these things in your household. Yeah. If you don't, that's okay. You can just watch here. Before we start, I just want to tell you guys, density is how complex something is. <laughs> you know, how tightly squeezed it is together. Now, how is it squeezed together? I mean, like, what is gonna press on it? Well, everything is made out of these tiny little particles called atoms. And those are joined together by energy. <laughs> and that energy is what keeps the atoms together. Now, in like some particular atoms have stronger energy bonds, so they're like more squished together, while some others are more light flowy and are easy to be separated. An example would be gas. Gas is very flowy. Anyways, so that's what density is. So that's a little quick check-in. Density is how compact something is. So right now we're gonna demonstrate density using some salt, and some eggs, eggs and some water. I might eat these eggs later. <laughs> anyway, so we're gonna mix some salt into one of these cups and turn it into salt water. And one of these cups is gonna be regular fresh water. Well, first, let's see what happens if you put an egg in normal. Let's see what happens. <laughs> so, is it gonna float with it? Why did it sink? That's because this egg is more dense. That's because the egg is more dense than the water. So the water is less dense than the egg, so the egg sinks, it can cut through. Now, we're gonna make the water more dense and see what happens if we put an egg inside. The egg still has the same density, around the same density it's as the egg. Egg as this egg. Like two eggs. Yeah, so let's mix in some salt. Can I only help you? No, yeah, so let's just pour it. Wow, look what happens! Wow, we're putting a lot of salt. Ooh. So now we're gonna mix it so that it all gets dissolved. Oh wow. I didn't know it turned this opaque. It looks like a glass of ah, it fell down. So now we mixed in all the salt. You see, it looks like a cup of milk, except it's a little more down the translucent side, which means it's half see through. It looks like milk. coconut, maybe? Oh yeah, it does remind me of coconut a little tiny bit. So now, let's see what happens here. You are a hundred percent right. Egg. It won't even go down. So the reason this egg sank and this egg floats is because salt water is more dense. So it's not allowing this egg to come through while the water, this is regular tap water. So this way, the egg is able to cut through and sink to the bottom. So that's the science behind density. <laughs> okay guys, so it's a pretty neat experiment. So you try this at home if you can. It's pretty cool. Well, so, so Yeah, look, this is not going down anymore. Yeah, I don't think it's ever going to do that until the water is like, they add more water or something. Anyways, thank you for watching. See you in our next episode. Bye! Thank
thank you for watching. If you want to see more videos, don't forget to subscribe. Bye.